Hey butterflies, it's your girl Pam and today I came to give you an update. Um, yesterday I got kind of, felt like I got gut punched just a little bit, but stay tuned. All right, butterflies, let's jump right in. Um, yeah, I'm a little sad today. My oldest twin um, decided that she was moving out yesterday. I kind of knew it was coming. Um, does it make it any easier? Do I know they need to go? I know it's time. Um, but I think it was just that whole, oh, I just wanted to let you know when well, she actually said she wanted to get permission from myself and from Janae, which I thought was very thoughtful, but she doesn't owe me anything. She's old enough. She's 22. I told you the twins are moving in with their boyfriends who actually are roommates but Brie has decided to stay just a little bit longer. Um, she didn't even know that Kiki was planning on moving. And um, I don't know if it was that I was hurt or if I wanted to completely support her. I'm hoping that it was a little bit of both maybe, not completely one-sided. So I said, what are you planning on taking? And she was like, my clothes. I said, well, no, we're, we're going to take everything. If we're going to leave, we're going to leave with everything. So he already had a mattress. Um, they did not, a mattress set. They didn't have a frame, but the frame she had did not fit um, the king size mattresses. And of course the headboard would not um, fit either. So that stayed, but she took her dresser. I put it in my truck and I took it right on over there. Um, and I came home and cried like a baby. <laughs> I cried while she was here, I cried when she left. We've closed the door um, just so we can kind of pretend that she's either at work or she is asleep. So uh, eventually, I I think when I come back from Jamaica, I am going to um, make that my studio, my YouTube studio. And then the other half of that will be Janae's gaming area so she can play her Xbox. Um, Brie has decided to stay um, because her boyfriend's mother still lives there. It's the boys. Um place they're the only two on the lease but I guess he was trying to help out his mom and she is supposed to be leaving and so Brie has decided that yeah I'm not going to quite leave my mother's house to go stay with your mother so that's her choice right now I totally understand it I totally agree with it <laughs> um Kiana's not really affected by it because it's not her boyfriend's mom. So the way that the place is set up, it's on a roommate style. So one is one bedroom and bathroom is on one side of the place and the other bedroom and bathroom is on the other side. So Key really doesn't have any kind of interaction with um, Bree's boyfriend's mom, <laughs> unless she wants to. Um, Is my heart broken? Yes. It is. But I have to trust the process. I have to trust that I've given her the tools and those foundations um, that my mom gave me. And, you know, I survived um, this big, bad world. Um, will she fall? Absolutely. Will they both fall? Do I still fall? Absolutely. But as my mother told me, you may bend, but you'll never break. And so I have to live by that. There's been some times in my life that people have totally 
left me out in the cold. Um, totally tried to break me, but I didn't break. And neither will they. They come from good stock, you know, and um, I have to trust the process. Um, am I concerned um, with the disorder? Yes. Um, because her and her boyfriend have the bipolar disorder. And so I'm a little concerned about that. I'm not going to lie. But, um, you know, I have to put them in God's hands. Um, even under my roof, I can't protect her from everything. So I, I pray over my children. I make sure that... Um, I made sure that I gave them back to him um, through baptism. And those are his children. He gave them to me and I gave them back to him. And so I, I pray for them daily um, to ensure that um, I have that peace of mind that everything is going to be all right. Um, so I just wanted to give you guys an update. Um, I'm, you know... I, you know what I want y'all to do? Help me think of a nice housewarming gift. I'm going to do one for Kiana, and then I'll do one for Brianna when she moves. I think Brie, hopefully, well, I don't want to say hopefully, because <laughs> I don't want her to move either. But um, when Brianna moves in the next, she says, the next couple of months, um, when the circumstances change, um then, you know, I want to do her a um, a nice housewarming gift also. So you guys leave me some suggestions below. Um, Janae, mm, she's not dealing with it too well. You know, it's been just four of us for so long. And so um, she has her moments. Kiana took two of the dogs with her. She took the girls. We kept the boys. Those are the ones that slept in the room with her. So it's a little quiet around here. Um, Tobias is still Tobias with his little puppy self. And Tank is older and he's not really wanting to fool up with Tobias so much. Um, but it's a little quiet around here. You go from four dogs down to two. It's a little quiet. So, um, But we'll get through it. We'll get through it. So make sure you leave your comments with kind of you know housewoman gifts you think I should get the girls separately and uh, make sure that you subscribe thanks you to every one of my new subscribers all of my longtime subscribers I love you guys so much and I appreciate you spending time with me um and hearing about my crazy crazy family and my crazy crazy world that I live in make sure you hit that subscribe button and the notification bell so it'll let you know exactly when I upload a video. Make sure you give the video a thumbs up. And until next time, butterflies, love you.